Hi, I'm making a little video on how to make a shared drive versus a shared folder. So to make a shared drive, you go up here in your drive, um, drive.google.com on your, on your URI account. And on the left-hand side, just below my drive is shared drives. Right click there and you'll see it says new shared drive. And in here you can write, what I'd like you to write is BAI 211 spring, so put a capital S, 23, and then your company name. Okay. Once you've created your um, new shared drive, it will, you'll know it's, share, it's a shared drive because up here in the kind of banner area, it doesn't say shared with me or anything about shared. It actually states the name of the shared drive and you can right click on it and manage members. And this is where one of you will need to make this and then add everyone, including myself. Um, and when you go in to manage members, um, the person who makes it is going to be the manager. And then other people can be added as content managers but I want, I want whoever makes this to add me in as a manager because that will enable me in the future to delete this shared account if you forget to so that we're not just building up a bunch of shared accounts on the cloud. Um, it also allows me to have a little more functionality um, that I may need to be able to see <clears throat> if work's been deleted and things like that. So you can, now that you have your company shared drive and not a shared folder, what you can do to build the folder structure is follow the information that I provided on Brightspace in one of the announcements. Um, I decided to go ahead and try to help you guys out a little bit more. Um, so I am, I put together a folder structure. So what you wanna do is go over to our Brightspace page um, so I am in content and I came down to the business analytics consulting company and down to data and templates. And over here, there's this shared drive folder structure. And in here, you can download a zipped structure. So once you download that, it'll be in your downloads folder. Then what you want to do is go to your downloads folder. Yeah, so go down your downloads folder and then find this um, zipped file. Sorry, I'm just trying to get me to change the name. I don't want to do that. So on that, right click and say extract all. Now it's going to ask you um, if this file is okay. And usually it's fine where it is. Um, we're just, this is an intermediary step because of um, and a little bit of an issue in the shared drives on Google, the Google shared drives, you can't just copy the structure very easily. So what we're going to actually do is um, use these that I created and upload that. So um, if you go to downloads, you'll see you have a shared drive folder structure. Um, and so what we want to do is come over to the um, share drive and come up here to say new and say folder upload. So once you have the folder upload open, go to your downloads. And um, I believe it only does one at a time. So there's a couple ways to do this. I'm going to just go ahead and get um, do one upload with the parent file. Um, that's called the shared drive folder structure. And I'm going to hit upload on that. Um, and once that is done, down here, you, um, my lower right, I'm getting a little window that's telling me um, what it's doing. And it's, it's giving me all kinds of false things about how much time is involved in doing this. So I'm going to pause the video until it's done. So now that it's done, I am going to open up this uh, shared drive and I see that I have all my tasks organized in here. So in um, 
order to enable Google Drive to upload folders, I had to put something in each one of these. So some of the, um, let me go back to one that we haven't actually started yet. So let me go over to task three, for example. I had to put something in these folders or it would not upload them. So a lot of these just have like the case study, this uh, PDF that we've been working out of. Um, but what I want you to do is now you can take them out of here and move them from the shared drive folder structure. You just right click and say move to, and then go up a window to where your company name is, and you can just save them here. So um, I'm just going to move each one. So I just right click, hit move to, and then click on this arrow that takes me up a full, uh, in the drive hierarchy, it's taking me up one. And um, I'm trying to move everything out of that folder structure. Now you see this is empty. So I'm gonna go up one. And here I have the three folders I've just moved out of this structure. And I'm going to um, move this one to the trash because it's empty now. Okay, and that's a way to import the file structure to your shared company shared drive.